Don't you find a little odd that for the last 34 years, if a person has a consistent behavior, why now? And I'm asking you this because you'll find all the greedy media details, like from all media outlet news, they're like they taking back the whole thing, uh, kitchen sink on this today. But that's not about that. The, the question, like the second level to this, is there are levels to things. Just asking yourself, why is it that like after 30 or 40 years or some, now is when people start coming forward? Who ignited this? Like, who started this? And this is what I have for you today, for you to like start asking yourself these types of questions. Because in reality, if you have a certain type of behavior, like when you have more money and power, it amplifies that behavior. If you are an idiot, you become like a super idiot, right? If you like a very mean person, you become even more mean because you have more uh, resources in, in your disposal. But that's not about that. I'm not defending anyone. I'm like against or favored about anyone. I'm on, I'm on my own side, as you should be. What we are talking about in this specific video is that why now, right? Don't you find that a little odd? It's not like something happened like completely out of the blue like last week and then completely blew out of proportions. No, that person has been like that like forever. Why now? My, my answer to this is most likely, if you are in a position of power and you are dealing with gatekeepers in industry plans, people that are like in specific places in the industry and very powerful people, some of them, right? If you piss some of those people off, they will bring you down. So something happened. The same thing like it was with the casino, like the movie, this probably you are much younger, you don't know about this movie, but it's a movie with Robert De Niro and Joe Pesci and Sharon Stone. They get like mobsters win like, like great like a casino like in Las Vegas. In the beginning, it was like all, all fine and dandy. But then they started pissing some locals off, right? And they brought all, the whole thing down. Plus other stuff, but the whole, the whole shtick to this was this. Like in the beginning, it was like great. And then they started pissing some people off. They were like in local like, um, like city mayors and all that type of people. Like they brought them down. So this is the same thing. They let you keep operating because they're doing the same thing, right? They they'll let you keep operating and do your thing until you piss some some of those people off, and then they will bring you down. Same thing with happened with like previous celebrities, and this is a, another case like like those. What I'm uh, thinking about, and I'm not wishing harm on anyone, but I'm not on anyone's side but my own, as you should be but it's unlikely that this person doesn't know who it was that brought him this, right? So he's gonna snitch. He's gonna tell, like, because he wanna save his ass, right? He doesn't want to end up, uh, like, in jail. And if people that put him there know this, they're probably going to do something. I'm not going to say this because it's YouTube, but I think you get, get the point. You, you have been building a track record of the last 30 or 40 years or something like with very powerful people, right? They now bring you down at, in the latter stage of your, your career, of your life, and now you wanna stay quiet? Right, so that's, that's the thing. This is not going to end up well. I hope it does, but I don't think it's gonna end up well. This is what I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to subscribe and click the notification bell so you'll know when I make more videos like this. Peace.